This lesson is devoted to our new project TopCrist. TopCrist includes several services that allow you to determine the topology of a compound and to find the representatives of a topological type. As you can see, it has two tabs. The tab Database allows you to find the topologies that contain the specified name including subnets of a given net. You should type the name of topology in the line. As you can see, it shows 10 random nets that contain specified symbols. The net which name is strictly equal to the specified one is always in the first position. For subnets, we can get the names that are written as the subnet transformation symbols. For example, it means that the subnet is derived from the net BCUX by decreasing its space group symmetry, shifting coordinate system and breaking some edges. If you click on any name, you will see the representatives of the topological type. It should be noted that some subnets do not correspond to real structures. You can download the CIF file with the topological properties of the net. It is possible for most common nets. In this line you can choose the database with the representatives of the topological type. Here the simplification method is specified. During simplification the underlying net is being constructed for the structure. Nodes of the net correspond to the structural groups of the compound. Edges correspond to the links between the structural groups. So the simplified net keeps the information about the connection of structural groups throughout the crystal. There are different simplification methods for different types of structure. Standard representation of covalent and ionic compounds means that the structure was not simplified. This representation is used for simple structures like sodium chloride or diamond. In standard representation of coordination compounds and valence bonded MOFs, the nodes of an underlying net correspond to the ligands and metal atoms connected by valence bonds. For inorganic compounds in the representation, the centers of the simplified net will be cations and anions. In cluster representation, the nodes of an underlying net correspond to the centers of the cluster groups. Cluster all nodes and cluster single node representations are described in details in the attached article. Standard representation of H-bonded or specific bonded molecular structures is used for molecular structures. In this case, centers of the net correspond to the molecules connected by hydrogen or specific bonds respectively. Standard representation of the Coulomb or VDW bonded molecular structures is used for organic molecular structures. The standard representation was used for the construction of such underlying net and all intermolecular bonds were considered. So, the centers of the net correspond to the molecular centers of mass, and the molecules are bonded by all types of intermolecular bonds. For each structure, there were generated all possible representations by subsequent breaking groups of weak intermolecular contacts with close molecular solid angle. As a result, the structure was considered at different levels of intermolecular interactions. The underlying net was considered for each level of intermolecular interaction to obtain the information about the way of molecular connection. It means that all contacts with a smaller molecular solid angle were broken. 
We successfully used this multi-level analysis for elucidation of organic molecular crystals. You can find more detailed information about different simplification methods in the attached articles, Topos Pro Practical Manual, our webinars, video lessons, the standard simplification method, and special methods of simplification on topospro.com. Let us look at the table. In the first column, you can see ref codes of the compounds. In the second, links to the database website. Here, you can look at the compound and at the main parameters of the structure. The Z parameter shows the number of symmetry equivalent nets in the structure. This parameter is important for interpenetrating nets. The column Property keeps the technical information concerning the simplification method. It may have different parameters for different simplification methods. As for standard representation of the Coulomb or VDW bonded molecular structures, it shows the minimal molecular solid angle, which is taken into account in the multi-level analysis, while for cluster simplifications, it shows the size of cluster rings used to discriminate intercluster and intracluster bones. The number of units shows the number of symmetrically inequivalent nets. This option shows the random set of most common topology. This 10 last added topologies. This tab allows you to find the topology of the compound by reference code. G-I-K-H-E-N. You should type the reference code in the line. Here you can see the topology of the compound. If we click here, we will see the reference codes of random representatives. If we press F5 button, TopCrist will give us other random set of examples. The Find Topology tab allows you to find the topology using the CIF file. You can open the file in the top crest window and determine the topology of the NAT. You can also see random examples of the compounds with this topology. So, we have considered all top crest options. For more information about simplification methods and topological properties of the compounds, see our lessons and webinars on topospro.com.